Well, in the end, a good win there by number nine, My Wicked Ways. Makes it two wins now from just the four starts she won under Mornay winner for the Glen Cotson Yard. Mornay, well done. Thank you, Miss Sally. Just take us through the race. It wasn't really watching you early on. Yeah, no, she, she had a nice lightweight today, you know, so... Um, so work has been good at home, so, yeah. Glenn told me just jump. If you have in front, I'll be happy, you know. But uh, there was a horse around me that was much quicker, so I just had a nice lead, you know. When, when I asked her to, to quick enough to come, let's go now, she gave it to me, and she stayed on nicely today. Yeah, I was running on all the way to the line. Looks like maybe a little further. Yeah, no, definitely, you know, but she's got a very low accent, so, yeah. But I, I think she'll go a little bit further later on, but she won a good race today. Well done. Thank you, and just well done to my sponsor, Gregor Stutz. So well done to them. Thank you. Well said. Thank you. Glenn Cotton, winning trainer, coming across to have a word with us. Glenn, well done again. Yeah, super, super. Um, last time out, uh, I wasn't Jen, I didn't see the race, but uh, I phoned up uh, Craig and I said, look, uh, she's uh, a kilo under sufferance or, or a half a pound under sufferance. But I think it's the right race. I said, you know, there's some big big guns in the race, but uh, let's just uh, give her a go. She, you know, she, she, I think she's very quick and we'll see how we go. But just uh, very, very well done. And uh, I believe Belinda and, and Wayne on the farm. So I know they're watching. So well done to the guys and uh, uh, back at the farm there. And... Uh, just uh, nice to have Craig, uh, Craig and Craig, and they'll take it further. <laughs> Strictly on form, though, it was hard to make a case for her. Yeah, last time out, uh, uh, Anton never rode her out. He didn't think she was striding out that well, and uh, uh, so from what I hear. And uh, but she has got that action. She's just like a ball of um, muscle, and she's just there's nothing wrong with her. She's just got that action because she's so muscle bound. So uh, maybe you could take that into account. But with bottom weight today, the track's running fast. Um, you know, a lot of those top fillies are coming back from a layoff. So um, yeah, you can I think it's obviously a prep run going forward. Well done. Yeah, thank you. Craig Kisvetter coming across on behalf of Ridgemont. We've had a lot of winners lately, Craig. Well done. Yeah, I'm not complaining. It's always nice to be up here, and uh, it's nice to be here personally as well for the Cotson Yard to, to have a winner with them. It's great. And she won very nicely. A little bit out of, you know, on form. She, you thought she might struggle, but she's come through. Uh, yeah, it's quite a contrast from the last run, I think, and um, surprised us, to be honest, you know, even with all the, the, the information that, we, that we've been given back. But... Uh, a fantastic ride from, from Mornay, obviously. Um, and obviously, well done to Glenn and the whole team back there. But um, it doesn't matter what sort of race it is, as long as you keep winning and keeping uh, the momentum going for the whole yard and the whole team, uh, it's fantastic. All her runs have been over 1,000. Do you think she could get a little bit further? Uh, why is everyone wanting to send horses further? As long as he keeps winning these sorts of races and keeps getting black type into them, then we're more than happy, and then he can do whatever he likes. But um, <laughs> for us, it's, uh, it's a program. He's, he's, he's set out a program for the horse, and it's not me to tell him how to train it. Why change a winning formula? Well done. Thank you. OK, there we go. That's uh, My Wicked Ways, number nine, who notches up her second win today and the Mornay winner.